A submarine bounces a wave off the ocean floor and records the time it takes for this wave to return to the boat. From this time it can be determined how far above the ocean floor the sub is. First we will list the information we are given in the problem. The frequency of the wave, the wavelength, and the time for the wave to hit and return back are given. Since the average velocity is equal to the distance over time, we need to find out how fast the wave is traveling so we can find the distance. We will use this formula to find the velocity of a wave. We substitute our numbers and find the velocity to be 1200 meters per second. Next we want to use our average velocity formula to solve for the distance traveled. We rearrange the formula to solve for d. We found the velocity in the step above. We need to find the time. Remembering that 10 seconds was the total round trip time of our wave, the time it takes to make one wave travel the time it takes the wave to travel to the ocean floor will be one half of our total time. The time it takes the wave to get to the ocean bottom is 5 seconds. We substitute this value along with our velocity in to solve for the distance and find the distance to be 6,000 meters or 6 kilometers.